Guys, um, I know I said that my next video was going to be like um, a tour of my Honeydew board, but I'm having some difficulties uploading that due to the length of it. So we're just going to pop in and do a quick little little something something here. Um, I'm a big fan of Local Eclectic. I think that they have really cute jewelry. And I saw that they had this thing called a surprise box for $59. So I ordered one. Um, it came in the mail the other day. I'm going to open it up live for you guys. Warning, I have opened this um, in the sense that I took the tissue paper off the first layer and then I was like, I should film this. Um, some details, $59, they are on sale right now for Black Friday. Uh, by the time I post this, it probably won't be on sale anymore, but I did use Honey. Uh, this is not sponsored by Honey, but it's like right up there in the corner. I do have that browser app. Um, I did use it and I saved 10%. So you can get a surprise box for $59 or a plus box for 118 and they ask you for your ring size. So I assume that you get a ring in there. Um, the reviews are pretty solid from what I've looked at. One of the biggest things that I kind of looked into was that a lot of people said that you don't actually get products from the website um, on in your box. So um, I'm going to take a look at it. I'm going to open it up live for you guys right now. And then we're going to go through and check the website and see if we can find the stuff that they sent me. So let me just angle this down for you. This is my keyboard. Um, the box came in one of their little pink boxes. It came in a bigger box as well. Uh, it took a a bit to get into because of the tape so I didn't film that but it looks like this pretty straightforward stuff labeled surprise six because my ring size is a six and then when we open it up I have seen a glimpse of this stuff and I was very excited so first thing that we have is a ring a size six ring tiny hands over here um it looks like an emerald almost uh I don't know if we can focus there we go almost uh, I know it's probably not it definitely isn't for the the value that this was for $59 there's no way they sent me an emerald but it's probably cubic zirconia very dainty very sturdy it's got cute little uh clear gem accents to it it's kind of like a flower that's what it looks like on yeah I'm pretty pleased with that it does fit uh, a little loosely this is um this finger is a size six and this one is a six and a half uh and this is a little too tight um, it's probably like just barely a six and a half, uh, maybe a little bit more. I don't know if I'm making sense. It's too big for my six, but it's too small for my six and a half. Um, but I like it. I'm a fan of that. All right. Next thing that I got were these earrings. Um, they're by a brand called Thai. We'll take them out the little Ziploc baggie. I am already obsessed with this. I haven't even looked at it properly. Uh, yeah, they're little star earrings. They're made up of a bunch of different gems. Um, not sure how I feel about these. They're a little too big for my taste. Uh, I know somebody who would definitely want them, though. Um, but yeah, standard backs. You've got regular backs here and then some cute little clear ones. I like the rubber backs, preferably just myself. But yeah, these are kind of cute, just a little too big for me. Okay. And then the last thing we have is this necklace, um, also by the same brand, Thai. So I'm kind of assuming that the ring is also by them. Um, let's pop that out of there. And we do have a website here that we can also take a look at um, if we don't find it over on the local eclectic site. But it looks to be just like this cute little opal necklace. Super dainty, super, super cute. I love opals. They're one of my favorite gemstones. Um, so really excited about this one. I don't know how long it is going to be. It doesn't seem like a very long chain. Um, so I'm probably going to have to put an extender on that because I don't like choker style necklaces, but definitely keeping this one. Um, so yeah, first thing we're going to do is we're just going to type in the brand name into Local Eclectic and then we will go to their actual website and see if we can find some info there. Um, also a note I want to make is like the inside of this box is really cute. It's just some, some minimalist art. Love that. All right. So let's give you a clear look-see here. Uh, we just search, see what pops up. We love slow internet. Um, so they have quite a few things on here by that brand. Uh, we're just going to take a scroll through, see if we can find it. I do love these hummingbird earrings. Um, see if we can find what we're looking for, or at least like a dupe of what we're looking for. Um, so we're looking for a necklace, uh, earrings, and a ring. I need these in my life, um, if anyone wants to send them to me. 
So, so far I'm not really seeing anything that could be a dupe of what we got. Um, we'll keep looking. We've got three or so pages left. Um, these are also really cute. This video is just like me being like, this is so cute. This is so cute. Okay, well, we've got some star studs here that are opal and cubic zirconia, and those are at 45. So I guess we could feasibly use that as, as a dupe if we needed to. We've got another set of stardust cluster studs here. Not quite the same. I would more go with the opal ones than the clusters. Hmm. I actually own this set by them. I, I didn't realize that it was by them. Um, yeah, it's not looking like we got stuff that was on the website. I'm not mad about that. I do think that it's really cute. I suppose if we had to, we could say that this emerald necklace would be a good dub for the necklace we did get because in terms of like style and production, it is pretty similar. Um, so that's at 55, which would be already meeting our value um, for what we paid for it. Yeah, I don't see on here. So let's go to their website. Let's go to tiejewelry.com. See what we find there. Handcrafted women's jewelry. Ooh, a Black Friday sale. No, I'm not gonna do that. We're here for a reason. All right. Um, just for the sake of consistency and being quick here, you can tell my boyfriend's been on my laptop. Um, tell if we could, just for the sake of doing this quickly, let's search star, see if we find our little earrings here. We've got these ones, rainbow star studs. Um, pretty close. Do a quick scroll through. Is that them? Oh, that might be them. That is them. Oh, cool. That's so cool. Okay, so we found our our earrings. They are $65 earrings. They're called Gold Pave Star Studs. Um, I wasn't expecting to find them on here. That's exciting. Cool. So let's take a look for our ring. Uh, let's see if we can narrow these parameters down a little bit because ring is very, very vague. Uh, can I? Hmm. I don't think I can narrow them, so I guess we're just going to do this quickly. Let's find our ring. Let's search. Let's search green ring first, and then we'll search emerald. Um, I doubt that it's an emerald, but you know. So green came up with three results. So let's see what we have here. Hmm. Yeah, it doesn't look like our ring is on here. Um, we can check the rings section specifically, see if we find it there. This lets us kind of refine by, by other things. So let's, it wouldn't be under simple because it's not quite simple. Apologies for keeping you all here for so long. Just, I'm determined, you know? Maybe it's a, what they call a pave ring. I guess that would be our, our best bet because it's not enamel. Huh, yeah, I don't think it's on here, which is fine. I think that that's fine. I love it, I'm obsessed with it. I'm not mad about it. Um, they do say that they give us stuff from their website, but I, I guess not. Um, let's take a look for our necklace here. Let's just search opal necklace, because we know that it's an opal, it can't be anything else. Opal necklace has revealed the following. Okay, 21 items. All right, so I think our best bet would probably be, like a dupe of it would be this mini opal pendant, pendant necklace. It doesn't have quite the same stuff, but it is similar in the sense of style. Um, and that retails for about nothing, because I can't tell because it's sold out, but um, <laughs> it retails for 70 bucks. So between the dupe of our necklace and our earrings, which are still in stock, we've already met our value. Um, we've actually doubled it. So. I'm not too upset about it. I'm not mad about it. Um, I think that it's a good thing for your buck. Would I do it again? 
I would probably do it again if I could specify like, hey, I like opals and I like emeralds. I wouldn't really do it again uh, on a mystery sense because uh, I don't care for these earrings. They're cute. They're just not for me. Um, but if you're looking to like test out Local Eclectic for the first time, I think this is a good way to do it. They do have a lot of dainty jewelry for sale. I love them. It's all handmade, I'm pretty sure. Uh, it's all small businesses. So if you are curious about them and you want to try them out, I would recommend doing this box first because you never know what you're going to get. Um, if you have any questions, please feel free to comment. I'll link um, the link for the surprise box in the description below. Um, yeah, I think that's everything. I hope you guys have a great day and I will see you on the next one. Bye.